meeting board of trustees for UISD today's May the 6th it is 6:03 p.m. and we're at the UISD boardroom here on 201 Lindenwood uh, Laredo Texas the subjects to be discussed or considered or upon which any formal action may be taken are, are listed below uh, the items do not have to be taken in order so on this meet, shown as shown on this on this notice uh, first as roll call Mr. Rodriguez could you assist us with that Jack Gilpin. Present. Ricardo Molina. Present. Javier Montemayor. Present, sir. Juan Roberto Ramirez. Present. Ramiro Vélez III. Present. Ricardo Rick Rodriguez. We have a quorum, sir. Thank you, sir. Let the record show that a quorum is, is present. Uh, so I call this meeting to order. Uh, number three, uh, Pledge of Allegiance. Pledge of Allegiance to the flag of the United States of America, and, and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Under the Texas flag, I pledge allegiance to thee, Texas, one state under God, one and indivisible. Item number four, closed session. The board will now adjourn into closed session pursuant to the following sections of the Texas Open Meetings Act, 551.071, consultation with board's attorney, 551.072, discussion on the purchase exchange, <coughs> lease or value of real property, discussions of proposals for sale and or acquisition of real property. Um, number one, discussion to adopt a resolution for the United Independent School District to solicit pursuant to local government code Section 272.001A, seal proposals for the sale of approximately 17 acres of real estate located east of Loop 20 and next to the school's district, the school district's food distribution center and the STEP Academy, and more fully described in the plat entitled UISD Central Kitchen Subdivision and any matters incident thereto. So it is. Six and, and then we also have uh, subsect. Oh, I'm sorry. B. I didn't see those. Okay, five five one one point zero seven one consultation with board's attorney. Five five one point zero seven four discussion of personnel or to hear complaints against personnel. One discussion including consultation with legal counsel. Proposed non renewal of term contract of Tomas Martinez. Appointment of board a board appointed attorney to conduct hearing and other matters related thereto. Two discussion including consultation with legal counsel regarding the termination of probationary contract of classroom teachers at the conclusion of 2013-14 school year. Three, discussion including consultation with legal counsel regarding the proposed termination of continuing contract classroom teachers. Four, discussion regarding level three grievance of Tomas Martinez. Five, discussion regarding level three grievance of Edna Olmeda. Six, discussion regarding level three grievance of Olga Vasquez. No. Just the time. It is 606. <coughs> Thank you. We're reconvened from closed session. The board will take appropriate action on items if necessary as discussed in closed session. A, action regarding the proposed renewal of contract, of term contract of Tomas Martinez. Appointment of board attorney, board appointed attorney to conduct hearing, authorize superintendent to send notice to employee. The recommendation regarding Tomas Martinez is for the board to authorize legal counsel to negotiate a uh, retirement agreement under the terms as discussed in closed session. Make a motion to approve. Second. Second. Any discussion? No. All those in favor? Madam pass the one abstention. With respect to agenda item um, 5B, the recommendation from the administration is to terminate Susana Herrera's uh, term con probationary contract at the conclusion of the 2013-2014 school year and authorize the superintendent to send notice to employee as discussed in closed session. So moved. Second. Motion to second. All those in favor? 
Those opposed? Motion carries. The recommendation agenda item 5C is uh, no action on uh, at the, because there's no continuing contract classroom teachers that uh, would require termination at this point. Uh, with respect to agenda item 5D, uh, the recommendation is for the board uh, um, not to take any action on this item. Um, so, make a motion to approve. Second. I have a motion and a second. Uh, any discussion? All those in favor? All those opposed? One abstention. And for the record, the level three grievance is therefore denied uh, as filed by Mr. Tomas Martinez and Human Resources will send out notice to the employee regarding the same. There's no action <coughs> needed for agenda item 5E or 5F as they were not presented. With respect to agenda item 5G, the recommendation is to table um, and bring it back to the board at the regular board meeting. I have a motion. I have a motion. Second. A motion and a second. Uh, any discussion? All those in favor? <coughs> All those opposed, unanimous. Motion carries. Uh, item, action item uh, number six. Uh, A, approval of board travel for the month of May, June 2014. Yes, sir. Uh, Mr. Multibayota, members of, of the board, uh, we have several conferences that, that again will will be before the our next board meeting. Uh, I think South Padre Island, uh, May 15th through the 17th, is Mr. Montemayor and Ricardo Molina. At the national conference in Chicago, Ms. Pat Campos will be going to that one. <clears throat> in the summer leadership conference, we have at this point all seven board members, and I know Ms. Uh, Campos will visit with staff. This is San Antonio. Uh, and that's basically our recommendations that the board approve, you know, all the travel. That's here. That's fine. Make a motion. Second. Motion to second. Any discussion? All those in favor? Motion carries. Uh, item action uh, seven, adjournment. Second. Move.